What is up guys? I am having to film this right here after I edited the video and everything because I have a quick story for you and I have to make excuses for um, something that happened. Okay, so basically my quality in this video is trash. I mean my quality has never been this bad and my camera right now the quality is not very good. I did get a new camera. It's supposed to be coming in next Tuesday so whatever blah blah blah. Well, just know that I got a new camera because my quality is already bad. This past weekend, I filmed my prom dress video. The video you clicked on, obviously, and you're going to watch, hopefully. I filmed the video and everything, and I went to go export the videos to my laptop with, like, the memory card into my computer, and it wasn't reading it. So, I was like, what the heck? And I looked at my memory card, and basically, I'd use in a broken memory card. I don't know how it broke, if it broke after I started filming, or what hang on my cat's crying and my laptop wasn't reading the videos and i could not transfer them <laughs> thank you i could not transfer them over to my laptop and but they were reading on my camera so then i tried a cord plugging my camera into my laptop with the cord that didn't work either and so i remembered that my camera has wi-fi transferring well i couldn't get the wi-fi transferring to connect from my camera directly to my computer so i had to connect it to my phone which this was a whole hour process in itself and whatever so I transferred them to my phone from my phone to my computer and in that entire hour process the videos lost quality and my camera was already not very good in quality so just keep that in mind while you're watching that I do know that it's not the best that it could be but this is a video I can't refilm because it's supposed to be my initial first reaction my first initial reaction so yeah, I just needed to make some excuses because I am the worst YouTuber ever and I say that twice in this video. This just adds on top of it. Hello, I'm Madeline. I'm the worst YouTuber in the world. Subscribe and give the video a like. <laughs> With that being said, let's just get on into this video and I apologize in advance for that. So yeah. Hey you guys, it's me Madeline and today we are going to be trying on some eBay prom dresses. I'm very excited. I have had these stowed away, stored away for a while now, almost about a month, and I'm finally filming this video. I have done a trying on Wish prom dresses and I also think two eBay dresses videos, so that equals three. I'm not too very sure. I will link them down below if you guys are curious. I had gone on eBay and looked through the dresses and I have found some pretty inexpensive dresses. I think they all ranged from about nine to fifteen dollars. And we're just gonna open them up and try them on. Okay. It's a two piece. That is very see-through. Let me see if it's supposed to be that see-through. Okay, I guess it is supposed to be that see-through. Good thing I have a black bra on. Okay, this is the first dress. We have a two-piece, very scandalous top that's basically no fabric at all, but it feels really nice. It's soft. It's not like that crunchy kind of, what is it called? lace it's not like that kind of crunchy lace it feels nice and the skirt portion actually feels nice as well it's pretty stretchy and it's like a silky material not that weird i'm sure you guys kind of know especially if you watch these videos and it's supposed to have like a little slit in the side yep and that it does does the picture have a yeah the picture has a little the picture has um what is this um 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 um, um. I keep forgetting the word. What is that word? I just said it. Fabric. No. Okay, I'm going insane. What is this word? Lace. Lace. Has that lace fabric down the side. And actually, I'm pretty excited to try this one on. I'm going to open them all up first. And then we are going to try them on all at one time. Oh, I forgot to mention. Sorry about the awful background my brother recently redid his room and took out his dresser and there's nowhere currently to put it so it's out in our open area and that happens to be where i film currently i have no open wall to film at and sorry this is what we're gonna have to work with i'm the worst youtuber i say that in every single video so 
cat. Let's pull this dress up before I open it and see what this is supposed to be. I'm assuming it's supposed to be this one. We have removed this idol. Instead of putting jewels on there, they put a pattern of jewels. Nuh-uh. <laughs> the color is pretty, but the jewels, I am dead. I am literally dead. All right, well that one will be fun and we have nothing to compare it to, but if it looked like this, I would have not bought it online. Let's just say that. Ooh, we got a pink one, we got a pink dress. Okay. Oh yeah, that one's really pretty. The color is a pretty good match from what I see so far. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to see what this looks like. It does have a slit. The fabric isn't that bad, but it's definitely not thick. It's not like what you would expect a prom dress to look like, but I feel like we can make it work. I guess we'll have to see what it looks like on. Next, we got a royal blue dress. Normally, you can tell if you're not gonna be receiving that dress if it looks like they stole it off the internet. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, it could be cute. It could be cute. I don't know. We'll have to see. It has some potential. It definitely has some potential. We're thinking positive over here. And the last one that we have is right here. And I think this is the short dress. Yep. Whoa, something just fell off. Oh, it's like a dress or a, a little belt. But we're gonna wear it as a scarf for now. Uh, so yeah, this looks like a basic little dress. My thought process on getting this is that I know most schools like the expectation for prom is long dresses, but some girls wear short dresses. So I got more of this one. This does not look like a prom dress. This looks more like an Easter Sunday dress, but we're gonna try it on. We are going to start with the last one, the yellow dress, and then we'll just work our way on up. This is the first dress and I don't really know how I feel about it. <laughs> I feel like if I were wearing a bra, which I don't have a nude bra with me right now because I'm at my house and I left it at my apartment. Anyway, I feel like it would be more flattering and like would pull up more. But right now, no bra, it is not cute. Does not flatter me at all, especially not like this model, which I'm not as skinny as her. But I feel like it should definitely be a little more flattery. And like I said, this isn't really what I had in mind for a prom dress or a homecoming dress. This is more of like a going out to Easter dress. Cocktail, party, evening, formal, ball, gown, prom, mini dress. They're trying to advertise this as a prom dress. I personally would not wear this to prom, but who knows? The color is really nice. I like the yellow and the top is not too see-through, I don't think. I'm probably gonna watch this back and be like, whoa, my area is showing. But as of right now, I don't think it is. It's a pretty nice length. It's not too short, not too long. I feel like it's cute. I feel like it's cute. I don't know. I just wish it hugged my waist a little bit more. You tell me. So this is dress number one. You guys normally give me some ideas on how I could um, alter it and whatnot. You guys let me know. What do you think? Here is the next dress. This is the one that had the fake diamonds on it. That's just like literally a fabric with printed diamonds on it. I feel like this dress would be more for like a little kid who wants to play princess or something. I ended up having to just tie the neckline because I could not get the stupid button through the little loophole. And anyways, it was going to be way too low down. Oh yeah, there's supposed to be like a slit in between. Not really there. Something's happening right here, making it look way too big. But I must say that the color is really nice and the fabric isn't as bad as you would think it would be. And I feel like it's not see-through. So that's definitely a plus. If the diamonds were real, I think this would be a steal, but I just feel like this needs to be taken in a little bit. Like I don't like how it's 
fluffy on the side and I don't have a picture of reference I can maybe go look on Google or something and type in this dress and see if I can find something I don't even know what it was originally called yeah it's completely taken off I don't know but honestly I'm not too mad at the dress I feel like it's pretty nice even though the diamonds are fake and it's just a print on it I hate this so much and I want it off immediately so this is the next dress this is what it looks like in the back i'm not very sure what it looks like in the back but it has like that um that mesh that's supposed to be skin like and yeah the dress is not very flattering and i absolutely hate the feeling of it it ugh, i hate the feeling of it i want it off whoa what is it why is it connected what? Oh my gosh, it's so staticky. Okay, we're taking this off immediately because I hate this. So here's one last turn and we're taking it off. Here is the next dress and whoo! Whoa, that almost fell off. Revealing. You can see all the way up my leg, but then again, if you think about it, if I were wearing shorts, it wouldn't be a big deal. I love this style and i love the color it's just a little see-through you can obviously see my underwear and i have nude underwear on and i can't tell if you can see through right here you can see how the fabric overlaps and it's like more opaque right here rather than over here i don't know if you could i don't know how to explain things i'm the worst explainer ever but this dress honestly feels pretty nice um it's supposed to be skin tight like this and I mean the color is a little bit off on camera but in person it's more of like a it's more of a bright baby pink <laughs> i don't know how to explain it but i like it it's pretty it's tight um it's just a little bit see-through which i guess it's kind of hard to uh master this cheap fabric i think this dress is pretty cute and i like the little slit on the side it's kind of scandalous that is what the back looks like i don't know can't see. I'll see whenever I'm editing. Oh my gosh, this was in that clip that entire time. Again, I am the worst YouTuber in the entire universe. Lastly, we are going to be trying on that black dress and that's what I'm most excited for. Well, I guess black two-piece. I put my hair in a quick little side bun. I probably should have done that for some of these dresses, especially that pink one, but just now thought about it. So this is the last dress the slit is not as obvious as i would want it to be i mean i have to like really stick out my leg for it to show but i mean it's it's cute is it something i would wear probably not but something and the fabric is actually really 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 nice for how much did i pay for this one 11.72 i mean i feel like this is a pretty good dress it is not see-through. It is a nice fabric. This, uh, why can I not think of it every single time? Lace. This lace fabric is not itchy like most lace fabrics that I've gotten in the past on like Wish and whatnot. Yeah, I feel like it's pretty cute. Would you rock something like this? I don't know if I would, but I think it's very cute. Where would I wear this to? I don't know, but... I have it in my wardrobe now. I wanted to feel a little risque and just basically wear a bra. Got this top now, you know? Make sure to let me know down below which one was your favorite dress out of all of them. Which one did you wish worked out the most? I think I wish that the pink one worked out the most. I think that one was gorgeous. I'll show it again on the screen. And maybe I guess the yellow one because that's more of like an everyday wear. I don't know. I feel like this one was probably the best. And if you guys could feel it, you would probably say it too. The main reason why I make these videos is to let you guys know, don't always trust the picture online. You never know what you're going to get, it, especially if it's inexpensive and it kind of looks shady. It's most likely shady. So just be careful on what you order. Sorry, Mia's being um, crazy. Just be cautious on what you order and basically why I make these videos so you guys can see what they advertise them as and then what you actually get I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please do not forget to give the video a like and make sure to subscribe down below and I hope you guys are having a great day or night whenever you're watching this and I hope to see you guys in my next video bye guys